Shalom Chevrei, or colleagues. This is Richard Solomon, and this will be a brief tutorial or demonstration on how you use Podio. Podio is an online collaboration and management web tool that can be used for teaching, such as Judaic teaching, or for staff development. Now I'm going to make an assumption that all of you can sign up for a Podio account and thus I'm going to go to my Podio account which is right here, Podio account for Richard D. Solomon and you'll notice in this column I have a listing of different workspaces or projects that either students or colleagues can work on. So my students or colleagues could work on lesson plans or activities related to Israel, history of the Jewish people, holidays. The one I want to share with you now is the one I created on jewisheducation.org and this was a pr project related to what web tools we should include in this particular course. Web tools for Jewish educators. Now I can list the number of people in contacts that I want to work on this project. And here is uh, their information. I can make as list as many people as I wish. Let's go back to the course. I can share apps with them. I can share links and files and memos. Indeed, if you look over here, I have shared with my colleagues course objectives, possible course objectives, movies, PowerPoints, benchmarks, lists of tools. I've also was able to uh, share with them information that is uh, on a Google Docs account, and a Facebook account, and a Skype account. And what's really interesting is you can invite specific people or students to be in charge of a group or charge of a task or activity. And you can communicate with them through this website through different forms of communication. You also can identify dates when projects begin and projects end. And you can list specific tasks. So, in short, what is Podio? Podio is an online project management and collaboration web tool that you could use with your desktop or laptop or even as an app with your phone. It identifies projects and people who are on those projects, activities related to those projects, when those projects should be done, the roles that people should play with regard to those projects, keeping track of that, timelines, upcoming meetings, etc. So, this is a brief demonstrational tutorial on how you use Podio with students in your classes or as a staff development tool. Thank you.